Hi, I'm Besa Kurbani and this is channel is BQ Geomatic. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to insert points to civil 3D and land, which will be the beginning of the next tutorials. I recommend that if you are not know the type of points, be sure to watch the video that I linked to the description and at the top of this video. If this is the first time you have selected my channel to watch, please subscribe and click the ring bell to be notified as soon as I post a new video. I'm also happy to write your suggestions and questions below this post. I have here the file of points I created in the previous video. As you can see, in this file, the columns are separated by space and in this file, the columns are separated by comma. As I said before, it does not matter with which character they are separated and both will have the same result. If the first columns in these files, the column we call the points number is letters instead of numbers, we will run into problem and the software will give an error when entering the points. So be sure to convert the letter to number in the same way as the previous video. Now I open Civil 3D software. I want to explain to you way to appear import points window. The first method I want to explain below is the same as the LAN software and you can use the same method in the LAN software. By going to point menu, select import export points and then import points. If menu bar is not displayed in your software, you can active menus from here by selecting show or hide menu bar. If your menus is hide, this phrase will be show menu bar. I go again, import export points, import points, and appear import points window. The second way to open this window is in the insert tab, select point from file, for our import section and third way you can go to home tab in create ground data panel select points menu then select point creation tools when the create points window is up here select import points icon here as you can see the import points window is up here from now on, all methods continue the same. In the window that appears, by pressing the plus button, I will introduce the file path of the points I want. Choose file of types to txt, and the files is up here. And press open. As you can see, the format of my points is accepted by the software. Formats are named in such a way that the letter P represents the point number, the letter E represents the easting or X, the letter N represents the north or Y, the letter Z represents the elevation, and the letter D represents the point code or description of points. The phrase in the parentheses also indicates that the above columns are separated by a space or comma. I open the points file again. You see the first columns are point number or P. The second columns is sting or X. The third columns is northing or Y. The fourth columns is elevation or Z. And the fifth columns is description or D, which are separated by space or tab. So the appropriate format for my file is P, E, N, Z, D, space delimited. In this section, the software show the previews of our point in selected format. If you can't find here your preferred format, you can create your own custom format because even that these formats by default are sufficient for our work, I will explain later in detail in the another video. If you want to group the imported points, 
click this option if you already have a group select in here and if you want to create a new group just click this button and give the desired name then press ok if you don't check and don't select a group in civil 3d software these points are imported into a default group called all points press ok the points have imported to our drawing but you may not see the points there are usually two reasons for this the first reason is that the points imported are in a position far from our displayed area where we can see all the points imported by zoom all in with the mouse or typing the ZE in the command line and press enter. The second reason is that the point style is such that nothing can be seen that we will talk about in more detail in the following videos. If you have not subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe and click the ring bell to find out the next video I will upload that it is, continue this topic and then start other topics. Thanks for following this channel.